that heartbreak is the most painful thing in the world? Personally, I think slamming into an iron gate is more painful. <laughs> so, there's this camp up in Fort Collins called CSU Equine Sciences. Obviously, it's up at the CSU. But what it is, is essentially you go for about a week, you go ride horses for around three hours to half, one and a half hours every day, you have lessons, all sorts. So I was really excited, this was my second year. I was meeting back up with some friends that I met last year, some new friends as well. So I get there, I'm really excited, I'm riding this horse I met last year who I hadn't been enough, advanced enough to ride. So we did great, so I moved up, but the second ride of the day, I moved up into the next age group. And they put me on this off the track racehorse. And we are going around, we're having trouble trotting, which is a step up from walking. And then we start cantering, which is a step up from trotting. And what we do is, um, so there's this thing called a crow hop, where all four of the horse's feet come up off the ground at the exact same time. So that horse does this, and I somersault off this horse's neck onto the ground. I don't hit my head, luckily, so. But it does get worse. So they thought it was a great idea, an absolutely amazing idea, to put me on this four-year-old, fresh off the track racehorse. So this is Charm, hence the title of the story. And I'm like, okay, I guess I'll hop on this horse. I mean, okay. So I'm hop I hop on this horse, we're going around, and we're back in the lower group because obviously, racehorses. And, well, this horse takes off towards the gate. I think, oh, she's just freaking out. So I think nothing more of it. We come to this basically, um, the game state, which is in this massive arena. It's used for dressage, jumping, all sorts. And we're warming up, we're doing fine, not great, but we're doing okay. And after the warm up, we're walking around. So this horse turns around and takes off. We're going straight towards the gate. I can see the gate, I'm freaking out. I'm like, oh my God, I don't know what to do. So I lean forward, which made the horse go faster, not the smartest thing ever, but I wasn't experienced enough that if I sat back, I would have been off the horse and not, that would not have ended well. So this horse is going straight to the gate. I mean, I'm freaking out. I'm trying not to let it show, but obviously. And um, this horse is what's called a dirty stop. She plants all four feet and leans back and goes from full speed to a dead stop. <laughs> I fly straight over the horse's neck and slam straight into the iron gate. Yeah, and then I slam back onto the ground and the horse just looks at, down at me like, human, what are you doing down there? <laughs> So, this horse is now fine. She's gone through a thoroughbred makeover program. I'm still riding. But one thing, there's a lot of, if you fall off the horse, get back on it. But sometimes, if you fall off the horse, just don't get back on that horse. <laughs> <laughs> Take it.